So technically, weathermen in the UK were illegal wizards for nearly 100 years. You've got to remember that for the longest time, nobody thought that the weather could be accurately predicted. In 1854, when John Ball addressed the UK Parliament, saying that the weather in London could be known a day in advance, he had to stop his speech because the crowd was laughing too hard. In fact, in British law at the time, if a person claimed they could predict the weather, they could be arrested in breach of the Witchcraft Act of 1735. Weather prediction was literally viewed as pretending to have magical powers. Yet, in 1854, the same year as that ridiculous speech in Parliament, Robert Fitzroy created the UK Meteorological Office. And in 1861, using a new network of weather observation stations around the country, started to predict the weather. This is the world's first weather forecast printed in the Times of London. So they probably repealed that witchcraft law, right? Like, clearly you could predict the weather. Nope! The Witchcraft Act stayed in law until 1951, so for 97 years, scientists working at the UK Met Office could have been arrested for claiming to have magical powers. 